Hi, this is Komal from KD Programming. Today I am coming with a new video or new program that is how to find area of circle, area of square, area of triangle, area of rectangle from little bit easy to little bit tricky. So first of all, I am going to show you, show you how to find area of circle. So first of all, here this is nothing but class of our program and this is nothing but main method of our program so inside main method as we know which parameter we require for finding the area of circle so first of all we require radius so enter here radius of type integer now this is not radius but this is variable for taking radius so again again we require one another variable that is of type double that is pi variable means as we know that in formula of area of circle there is r square into 3.14 so 3.14 is nothing but a double value so for that i require double pi equals to 3.14 so i will require this two variable as input and another again I will get one output that is area so I will declare here double a now user should enter the radius of circle so first of all just pass one message that is sys out in that enter radius of circle again after passing this message we have this value at runtime for that we have to create the object of scanner class so syntax for that is scanner i am using here reference variable scan so scanner scan equals to new scanner in that i am passing system dot in so here one error is visible that is after creating the object of scanner class we have to import the package of scan class so here just double click on it and here we can observe that this is nothing but the package of scan class so after creating the object of scanner class we have to call one method for getting this input value that is r at runtime for for that i am using this reference variable scan so scan dot next int and we have to store this value in the variable r which is nothing but our input variable so r equals to scan dot next int so now now user will visible this input value of radius at runtime but what will be happen at the time of calculating area of circle so let us see as we know what is the formula for finding the radius of or finding the area of a circle so let us see a equals to that is for area i am taking here a so a equals to radius r into r into that 3.14 so this is nothing but formula for finding the area of circle so here it is formula so now we have to print this value simple now sys out statement and again area of circle is plus here it is a so this is nothing but here we have to keep in mind just only one line that is the formula and we have to print this value of area that is the thing there is no any rocket science so first of all save the program and run the program again here enter in radius so i am entering here 2 
and we can observe that 2 into 2 into this 3.14 is nothing but the 12.56 now now like that I will show you how to find the area of circle now first of all create new class now square and click on this method and click on finish as like area of circle again in square also we have to enter first of all sides means sides length so for that i am taking here integer variable so int yes and also if this sides is integer area will be also integer so i am taking here a1 now first of all we have to enter this side now so pass one message that is this out here enter side length of square after that as i told you you have to create one object of scan class for getting the side value this side value at runtime so scanner r equals to new scanner in that i am passing system dot in as i told you we have to import the package of scan class at the start of program so after creating the object after import the package we have to call this input value or we have to see or we have to get this input value at runtime for that i am using here next int method and i want to call this method by using this reference variable r so r dot next int and store this value in variable yes yes equals to r dot next int so user will read this input value at runtime or will get this input input value at runtime but we have to find the air area of square so formula for that is a1 it's too much simple that is side into side is nothing but the formula for finding area of square so we have to print this area so sys out in that area of square is plus a1 yeah this is nothing but simplest program or simplest logic for getting the area of square so now again save the program and run it no now enter here i am entering here 2 yeah it's true 2 into 2 is nothing but 4 yeah now i will show you how to find area of rectangle again this is same process same process we have to repeat for uh, rectangle for triangle now I, sh I will show you as i told you in every program we have to create every new java class so here that is triangle or i will show you first of all rectangle because i am going from little bit simple to li little bit difficult so rectangle a click on this method and click on finish as usual as usual we have to declare variables inside main method so there are three variables i will require for this finding area so length and breadth are nothing but two input variables and area is nothing but output variables so l comma b comma a2 and we have to pass one message as we know sys out enter value of length and breadth 
now enter value for length and breadth now we want this values at run time again so scanner r equals to new scanner in that i am passing system dot in now import the package of scan class again we have to call this method at forgetting this value at run time i am using here next int method so r dot next int but here in this case i want two values or two values at run time that is l equals to again b equals to r dot next int here now formula for finding the area of re rectangle is nothing but a means a to i am taking here a to equals to l into b it's simple l into b now we have to print simply sys out area of rectangle is plus at yeah just save the program and run it enter any length and breadth so i'm entering here 2 3 so here we can observe that area of rectangle is nothing but 6 now to finding area of triangle there is one formula which will be little bit tricky so first of all watch the video till end so first of all create new class for finding the area of triangle so here it is triangle click on this method and click on finish as usual declare variables first of all here i am declaring int a b c four sides and here is one another variable that is esp it is nothing but semi parameter of a triangle so here and again a1 again a1 for a1 will be of type another type so again here pass one message that is sys out here enter values of sides again same process that is scanner r equals to new scanner system dot in again import the package same 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 process yeah click on this method again here it is in small now call this three variables or forgetting this three variables at run time use next int method so r dot r dot next int store this value at a again at b again at c now there is one formula for finding the semi parameter of a triangle so esp is nothing but semi parameter in that inside bracket we have to add these three sides and divide it by 2 see again divide it by 
again for finding the area of a triangle there is one formula which is little bit tricky not too much but little bit so here it is i am taking a3 so i want to declare this variable again a3 equals to math there is one by default or default class in java that is math and here it is one method that is sqrt i am using here math dot and this method or this class is coming in under lang package so java dot lang package so math dot sqrt in that here we have to multiply this semi parameter sorry to yes sp minus a into in another bracket sp minus b in another bracket sp minus c so this is nothing but formula for finding area of a triangle but i want to declare here one variable that is again a3 but this will be of type as i told you double now just print this area so sys out area of triangle is a3 just save the program and run it again now we have to enter this three sets that is i am entering here 1 2 and 3 so if this area becomes zero by counting using this formula because if a plus b plus c means i am taking here 1 2 3 1 plus 2 plus 3 is nothing but 6 and 6 is divided by 2 is nothing but 3 so by using this value by after doing calculations area becomes zero now these are nothing but the four simplest programs for finding areas of circle square rectangle and triangle